there's something that takes over on stage. You become a little bit of a different personality because I'm really immersed in my playing and just giving my utmost to the music and to the audience. There is certain certain sense of uh, silence or this kind of air in in the in the audience, especially, and you especially feel it when there is nothing being played. I was already teaching at Manhattan School of Music. A friend of mine sent me a note or text asking if DU is recruiting. It's a great school. And uh, this sort of just fell on my lap and I thought, well, this is perfect. This is what Lamont is about, and uh, the faculty is great, and, um, and it's, it's a great place to be, a great place to recruit for, because we can speak uh, what we intend to do, and we know what we are going to do. It's a small enough school. It's not small school, but it's small enough, where, where students uh, get experience at all times. If I have six bassoonists, they, they get to play either in orchestra, or uh, the wind ensemble and do chamber music all the time versus uh, bigger schools uh, where, where if the student doesn't do well in the audition they might just be left out for the whole semester or maybe even whole year of, of a large ensemble such as orchestra ensemble that's a problem i grew up seeing my mom teach uh, kids from young age the program was for seven years in Estonia, up until they're in their, well into the teens. So it's, it's in my genes. When I was at, at Yale, uh, between 92 and 95, I did not remember a word to this thing that you hold th things in a cold box. You put them in and it's a cold box. And this guy says, oh, you mean a refrigerator? I said, yes, yes, refrigerator. Well, that guy was Christopher Theophanides. And uh, so that was our first conversation. And uh, we became very good friends. And two years later, he um, conceived the a, a, uh, bassoon concerto. So it's not a new piece. Um, and we worked on it together. He wrote it for, for me and for my wife, Tiu, um, for our wedding. Since then, I've I performed this piece many times, many times. For one reason or another, finances, etc. I've recorded other albums in between. It's a huge honor, of course, uh, to be part of uh, su such a great project. Um, this, it's nominated for the Best Contemporary Composition Award. And, and uh, to be the one who basically conceived the, 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 the project, premiered it, um, is, is amazing. It's a colossal honor just to be nominated. I mean, there are hundreds of recordings being sent in and to be one of five in, in this project, even if it's a composition that, that officially has the nomination, but without the performer, that wouldn't be a composition, I would say. I open myself up to the audience it's through, through, through this instrument. Um, and uh, it's, a, it's an incredible gift to be able to, to, be able to do that and something I would never, I would never take for granted. Um, and and uh, I appreciate the audience very much.